<laughs> Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you've never been here before, my name's Emma. Make sure you click that subscribe button to become part of the family. <laughs> so today I'm bringing you another haul video and I've teamed up with Georgia Asda to bring you a little springtime haul. So I know most of you are probably thinking, Georgia Asda? But you know what? I have shopped at Asda for the longest time. So their clothes go all the way from, I think it's about a size eight, all the way up to a 24 and even a 30 in some of their coats and jackets. I've always got my underwear from Georgia Asda. The swimsuits are really good, which we'll get into later. They have actually a really good range of clothes and especially they've just brought out their spring collection. So it's full of like florals, summery bits for your holidays. Okay. You need to be, oh, you need to be quiet. Yeah, so let me just put it out there straight away. This video is sponsored and it is one of the first like sponsored videos on my channel. So hopefully you guys will receive it well. You always know you're always gonna get my 100% opinion. I think you already know that by watching my whole videos. Like I don't hold back. So you know you're always gonna get my 100 opinion. And I'm really excited to show you guys these pieces because they're so affordable and they have really good quality. So. Shall we just get straight on into it? If you are in the States, you might be thinking like, what's Georgia Asda? Basically, I think Asda in America is Walmart. So it's basically like, sort of like a supermarket that has a branch of clothing through their supermarkets. So that's what Georgia Asda is, just to clear that up. And yeah, I'm so excited to show you guys the pieces. I think you're gonna be really surprised by how cute these pieces are. So let's get straight on into it. Okay, so starting off with this blouse. So this is called the Crochet Trim Tie Neck Blouse. It's 16 pounds and I got it in a 22. So it's basically just this little white top. It's kind of giving me like boho, folky kind of vibes. So it has this little crochet detail on the sleeves, also on the chest area with this little tie up, which I think is so cute. And it has little, little beads on the end of there. I really like the neck detail. And yeah, it's like a three quarter arm and it's got a bit of a waistband here, which is gonna give you more of a shape rather than being so like and giving you nothing. So I really like this top. I think it's really summery, springy. Definitely gonna be a great piece to wear when the weather gets a bit warmer because the weather is a bit mad right now. It was sunny yesterday, today it's raining. I just can't figure it out. But the material is really nice. Although it's kind of, it is a thin material, so it's lightweight. You, I do have a dark bra on. You can sort of see it a bit, but it's nothing too major. Like I could definitely still wear this bra with this shirt. This isn't actually usually something that I would go for, but I do really like it. And I feel like it's more of like a classy piece. Like I could wear this to Sunday dinner with my Nana and my family. Like, I think it's a really nice way. Just like, I've just got jeans on with this. It's just a nice way to jazz up an outfit by wearing a little cute top like this. Let's go on to the next one. Next is this jacket, which I am obsessed with. I wore this jacket the other day and everyone was literally asking me, where is your jacket from? It's so nice. And I was like, girl, it's from Airs though. This is the faux suede biker jacket and it's 28 pounds, 28 pounds. And I got it in a size 22. So it's really, so I don't know if you can see my face, girl. It's a really soft sort of faux suede material. It has two pockets here, which you can also zip up as well. And the little neck details, the poppers, zip detail all the way up here. And the stitching is kind of exposed, if you can see. If you can see at the back, the stitching is kind of exposed, which I really like. But it is so soft. And the material it is, it's not like, um, a really strict material. Like what I mean by that is like this is really, it's got some stretch to it, which makes it a lot more comfortable to wear, especially if you were gonna zip the jacket up. So if I zip it up, it's actually still really, oh, it's actually still really comfortable to wear and not like a walking around like this. They also do this in a camel color, I think which will be cute, but I just thought pink, you know, spring. I'm trying to bring on the good weather. Yeah, it's all, it's sort of that material. It's gonna keep you warm in like April, May, you know? It's not too thick, but it definitely is not thin. It's not thin, but it's definitely not gonna make you overheat. 
So I think this is really cute. The arms are long enough as well. I just really like this jacket and yes. Okay, so next is this floral polka dot skirt. I got it in a size 20 and it is £12.50. So I am actually so in love with this. So for summer, like I really want to get more into like these kind of like flowy, cutesy skirts. Like it's sort of like grandma chic. Do you know what I mean? Like we're hitting you with the grandma chic. So it's basically just a polka dot skirt and it has got little flowers all over it. And it's also got buttons all the way down the middle, but it's actually really good because these buttons, they're not like where it'll undo. So like you aren't gonna be exposing your knickers to anyone, which I really like a lot. Also the front looks like a normal, like a skirt, but then the back is elasticated. So I could have really, I could have gone down a size in this and I was scared it wouldn't fit. So I could have definitely afforded to get an 18 in this because it is stretchy, like there's room, honey. Yeah, I just really like that because I don't like skirts that are elastic all the way around because I feel like it makes the outfit look a bit like meh. Like this looks clean and nice. I like that a lot. But the skirt comes down just past my knees. You know I'm quite tall, I'm five foot 11. So this could definitely be hitting some people mid calf, which I think will be cute as well. The shape is just really nice. So it's, it's like highlighting my waist and then skimming over my hips and making it look all cute. Yeah, and some of these are great. If you tend to chafe between your thighs, you can just literally wear like a little pair of um, cycling shorts underneath. That's what I usually do in the summer. Or you know, talcum powder is your best friend also. I will definitely be wearing this. I even, I like it with this top as well. This is from that, another Boohoo haul that I did my most recent one. This with like a pair of Converse, like some cool sunglasses. This will definitely be a look. Do you know what else I really like? They send everything with the hangers. So when you receive your package, you have all the hangers. You haven't got to worry about where am I gonna hang this? It comes with the hangers. Okay, so next are these tropical palazzo trousers. I think that's how you say it, palazzo. I got it in a 22 and it was £12.50 again. So these are like, it's like the, for the skirt where it's like normal material on the front and then elastic on the back, which I do really like. Now, the good thing about these pants is they are long enough for me. So a lot of pants will be hitting me a bit mad, but these, they're hitting the ankle. No, they're, they're past the ankle. It's a good fit. It's definitely a good fit. So they're basically just navy and they have little tropical flowers all over them with leaves. These would be so cute for holiday. So if you're like on a beach holiday, but these would be great for at night going out and also like around the pool in the day. Although they're hugging my tummy, it is not unflattering. So it is, a, it's not too tight around here. Like I can, I still have movement, but they're definitely not making me look like, mm, you know, I feel like, do you know what I mean? Like when you get a pair of pants and they're high waisted, but they're, they're a bit more form fitting and it like hugs your tummy and gives you camel toe at the same time. Like, what are you doing? But these are definitely not doing that. I have so much movement. Wide leg, but they're not too like, boom. They're not too wide leg. And you know what else I really like? They're not too tight on my thighs. A lot of the time if I buy a wide leg pair of pants, they're tight on my thighs and wide leg on my calf. And I'm just like. But this isn't doing that, which is so cute. I'm at £12.50. So next we're moving on to the swimsuits, which I'm really excited to show you guys. Let's get into it. Okay, so next is this ruffle swimsuit in blue. It's 14 pounds and I got it in a size 20. You know what? I am really impressed with this swimsuit. I really love the color, first of all. I think the color is so cute. And a problem I have with swimsuits is that they don't fit my torso. So I am 5'11 and I have quite a long torso rather than like long legs. So to find a swimsuit that like pulls up and is not too short, like not cutting up here or not too low on the, on the chest is quite difficult. And I got this in a size 20. So I was even more skeptical. Like I'd normally get a 22, but I thought, let me just try it. And it fits perfectly, like so perfect. So it's covering everything down here. The bum isn't too, um, it isn't too like exposed either. We like the neckline as well. It's not really a, a shape that I see. So it's more of like cut in here and these little straps, 
which is good on holiday because you can just take these down if you like want to tan your chest. And then also there is this little ruffle detail here. Yeah, there is like little cups in here. So there's like a proper boob bit. Like I don't really have a big chest, but if you did have a big chest, there's like a proper boob support bit in here. Back is like covering all my back fat and yeah, I'm really, this is a really flattering swimsuit. So I obviously have a belly, but you can't really, do, like, it's, it's all a bit mad. It's just covering it, which I really like. It is really smoothing me out rather than clinging to my lumps and bumps, which I am impressed with for a 14 pound swimming cozy. So yeah, this is definitely a winner winner chicken dinner. Okay, so next is this embroidered stitch plunge costume. It is £16 and I got it in a size 20 again. It's basically navy and it just has all these little cute embroidery bits all over it. So it has like little butterflies, flowers, some more flowers down here. It also has like a little stitching detail on the chest, which I think is really cute. So this one is like a tie it yourself. It just goes around the neck and then you tie it to however tight you want it. The back is a bit lower than the other one. So I'm showing a little bit of back fat, you know. But if you wanted to have it lower, you definitely could have it down here. But you know, I'm just trying to cover them bits up. Again on the bum, it is covering everything, not too much cheek, which is great. This one is a little bit shorter in the torso. So it is coming up a little bit higher around here and a bit lower on my chest. But it's definitely still very cute and still definitely can wear it. If you were a bit shorter than me, It'd be definitely perfect. It's just because I have such a freakishly long torso that everything doesn't fit me right. Also, I like how most swimsuits, if they have a deep V, like it's just deep V and nipple to the wind, do you know what I mean? But this has this little thing here, so it holds it together, so you're not, you know, exposing anything to anyone. I'm really impressed by these swimsuits. Again, it's like skimming over my curves and my lumps and bumps without like cling into them. I like how it's like showing a bit of booby too. Like I don't have, you all know, like I don't have the best chest. Like, well not the best, but like, it's not that big. It's a bit like saggy boobs matter, you know, like gap tooth titty committee. This is like bringing them together. They're going to be in unison. Do you know what I mean? Definitely very cute. <gasps> okay, so that was everything that I had to show you today. I'm, you know what guys, like, I'm really impressed. I always, I've always gone to Asda with my mum, like every time we go to Asda we have a look around the George section. I'm really impressed by their summer pieces, like it's definitely very on trend. All the pieces are really cute and really well fitting, especially for a plus size girl. Because trust me, I know how hard it is to find well fitting clothes as a plus girl. To have these that are so affordable and so like accessible because if you go to any big ads they're like there's a george section and they go up to i think yeah i said before they go up to like a 24 and everything is well sized like it's not too small if anything the clothes are like a smidge too big so you know what i'm very pleased with it i'm very very happy with it also the underwear section is great and the pajama section the pajama section is what dreams are made of. The amount of as the pajamas I have is unbelievable. So yeah, I got them delivered next day delivery and it came pretty quickly. Well, it came next day, obviously. But yeah, I really like how it's delivered with the hangers. That's a big plus for me. Also, I'm pretty sure you can get the clothes delivered into store and you can pick up from your nearest Asda if that's something you want to do. Yeah, so all of them clothes came up to like under £100, I'm sure. So yeah, I'm really happy that I got to show this brand to you guys. Like, I guess normally like this sort of thing wouldn't be shown on YouTube, but I'm really happy that I can show you all kind of various brands that do well fit in plus size clothes. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. And let me know what your favorite piece was as always. This is like the first time I've like done swimsuits on my YouTube channel, but there'll definitely be some more in the summer months. So be kind to me, you know, exposing my, my thighs and my cellulite to you all. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you soon. I've got a few more hauls up my sleeve. So stay tuned. That was so cringy. Why did I just do that? <laughs> Love you all. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for supporting me. It's making me, you know, I've already said this, but I love it so much. Thank you so much. And I'll see you next time. Bye.
Shoot, 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 shoot.